I'm referred many patients for glaucoma. But glaucoma isn't just one diagnosis, it's actually many different diagnoses. And one of the first division points in determining how glaucoma is treated is whether it's open angle or narrow angle glaucoma. And narrow angle glaucoma, also known as closed angle glaucoma, is one of the most missed diagnoses. So how do you diagnose angle closure glaucoma? Well, it turns out that examination with a microscope, also called a slit lamp biomicroscope, is important. But true diagnosis of narrow angle or closed angle glaucoma relies upon an instrument called a gonioscopic mirror. And it looks like this. So the gonioscopic lens allows us to see structures in the eye that can't ordinarily be seen with, normal, with the normal microscopes. So let's show you how it's done. The eye is numbed and it's applied directly to the surface of the eye. Looking through the mirror, you can see the reflection of the iris below and the cornea on top, and the space in between is called the anterior chamber angle. Currently, we're looking through one of the mirrors of the gonioscopic lens as it sits on the eye. If your eye doctor measures high pressure of the eye, make sure that he or she performs a gonioscopic examination.